Hi, hi, every baby. Welcome to or welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Kitten, and today I thought it would be a nice day to maybe get one of the Reborn dolls dressed up and for us to go out. My online caregiver, Daddy Bear, has offered to get me an Easter basket, but because he is all the way in Germany, we have to go out and, you know, put it together ourselves. So we kind of have a mission today to get Easter basket supplies for myself, so I get an Easter basket this year. I thought it would be really fun to take one of the babies out. Right now my collection consists of Ellie and Chi. I'll show you them. This is my little Ellie, and we have to change the babies regardless because they're in like jammies right now but she is the newborn size one um she's got like the cuddle body and then everything else is silicone uh and then we have chi who is totally silicone we got little chi and like i said they are like in full jammies this is the little onesie set that i have that actually matches wasn't sure if i wanted an awake doll so like how her eyes are open or if I wanted to bring Ellie who you know she's like asleep and it's like more incognito so it doesn't feel as weird like walking around with her so maybe we'll bring Ellie today I gotta move the babies around because this is the only carrier I have let's find clothes for Ellie all of these bins are like squished with stuff oh I forgot that I got these passies those are for cheap um but they're all different is this the newborn sizes find something that's appropriate for today it's like a really beautiful day out so i'm gonna try to find something springy are these these might be like mostly little boy clothes i really need to organize these things i got my tripod out so hopefully this helps come here little girl oh where did our passy just go oh i see it okay so we'll lay her down she takes um, a newborn, or no, it's a preemie size passy. So in case you guys are wondering, squeezing the cheekies like that and then like gently working it in. You wanna be really gentle because you don't wanna like mess up the paint or anything on them. So in case you guys didn't know, so her body is like this cloth material, but she's like filled, I think it's like weighted polyfill or something it's called i'm not sure but her limbs are silicone there is a full silicone version of this doll um renee mackie i think that's how you say renee mack oh i can't remember <laughs> um but it's on etsy and she's the one who uh created this baby for me so in case you guys hadn't seen her she's so beautiful her rooting is stunning. Renee did like everything. Like she did the paint, she did the pour. Oh, there's glitter in her hair. But like, I'm blown away by this doll. The paint is still like to this day, like one of my favorites that I've ever seen. Um, so if you can tell, I kind of like gently roll the uh, clothing off of her body. Cause I just, I really don't want to mess up the paint it's just she's so perfect every little detail she's so cute okay let's get her dressed i was trying to decide i do have like some long sleeves so i could always you know put a long sleeve onesie on her that i want her to wear like everything it's purpley gray with this and we can get her some like little Sockies and shoes. There's like this purpley, like a really purpley jumper. I'm sorry, I'm just literally piling clothes on top of you, baby. I'm so sorry. Look at this. There's two bins of clothes that are specifically her size. Oh, what am I gonna choose? I have Winnie the Pooh stuff. <gasps> stuff that has to go over her head like this. Just be really gentle. There. <laughs> I just don't want to ever hurt her paint or her silicone. Sometimes I watch other YouTubers who have reborn dolls and they do like little hacks. Like they'll put socks on the baby's hands, especially if they have fingers like this, because all of her fingers are separated. 
Um, and like, you don't want to accidentally get it like snagged when putting on a shirt like this, but I think I've made a decision. I have this like little jumper that will go over this and it's got like little bees on it. And I think I'll swap out her hair bow with this yellow one. Oh my gosh. And then obviously something for her little tootsies. Goodness, your hair is crazy, girl. Got wild, crazy baby hair. Outfit, look at how precious. Oh my goodness. All right, she is all dressed, and so am I. So I'm gonna get her a blankie. I'm gonna shift Chi over in the bouncer and put her in the car seat, and we are going to head off to the store. Chi is huge in comparison to Ellie. Look at this. Oh, he can't even see her. She's <laughs> three to six months. Let's get her something to play with so she's not sad. There you go. She, she looks so grumpy. Oh, let's get this little girl. Oh. Comfy and in here. I don't know if I'm gonna buckle her in all the way or not. I don't know if the um, straps are adjusted for her or for Chi. Is this a winter blankie or? I think this is fine. Because it, it isn't like super like, warm out. <laughs> Baby little bunny. And we'll bring this. I'll put this on the side of my bag or something. Her in the back. I don't want to necessarily lock her in. So I'll just set it like that. She should stay. Okay. No, oh, she looks so cute. Okay, it's actually a little bit warmer than I thought out. I looked at the um, temperature on my phone that said it was only gonna be like 40. It feels like mid 50s, so that's good. But I'm gonna drive now. Um, I don't know where my first stop is gonna be, honestly. I was considering Walmart. Um, it's just cheaper to like get some stuff from there. Um, I don't know. I'm scared to bring Ellie in Walmart because I've never gone to Walmart with one of my babies. And sometimes people are just like really nosy. I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Uh, it probably would save me more money to just go to Walmart. Hard to get anxiety for no reason. <laughs> I tried to park next to a cart return so I wouldn't have to walk with Ellie, but um, all of the carts are inside, so darn that. Okay, we actually got lucky because um, somebody behind me was just finishing up with a cart, so I was like, can I have that? Oh my god, the sun is so in her face. Sleepy little cutie. So I need to get some like necessities first and then we're gonna get to the fun stuff. But I need to just grab like a couple of grocery items just as long as I'm out because this homebody hates leaving. So I'm gonna try to one-stop shop with my little girl. Ooh, we're still doing our necessity shopping, but I did come across a candy aisle and they got a ton of Easter candy, so let's look. Okay, honestly, I'm looking for the non-dairy Lindor chocolate, which probably will not be in this section, but there is a lot of Easter stuff. I wonder if I need to grab some of this here or if they have it specifically in the Easter section. <gasps> is that bluey Easter stuff? Oh my gosh, so cute. There's so much cute stuff. I don't think these are the oat milk ones. Oh, I'm so sad. I saw them online like on Amazon, but I really wanted to buy them in store. Are any of these? Any of you guys? Oat milk? Oh, what's this? Was this a vegan brand? Mr. Beast? Nope, milk chocolate. Okay, I don't know. I'm just trailing her along. She's being a good girl. <laughs> we'll go to the baby section after. I have the squeakiest car ever. I didn't realize that because I have my headphones on. I think I'm going to be SOL when it comes to vegan candy because I like I like chocolate I'm a chocolate girly like jelly beans a couple here and there that's fun those are fine but 
I want a chocolate for my Easter basket. This kind. Uh, one of these for Hashi. Okay, necessities have been gotten. <laughs> She's just sharing the cart with the groceries right now. But look at guys. <gasps> Winnie the Pooh bibs. Oh, they're so soft. Not gonna lie, I would I would like this in my size. I've been seeing that more, the neat brand. It's so cute. <gasps> oh my gosh, these are adorable. For me, maybe. <gasps> my babies wouldn't fit in this, I mean, but they're really cute. I mean, low-key, I always come in this aisle just to look for me, but now I have an excuse. Not that I ever need an excuse. Oh my gosh, what a cute little cuppy. I've literally never seen a preemie passy. What is this? Nope, zero to six months. I need the really itty, 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 bitty ones. I want like a cute, different one for Ellie. Even online, it's it's just this one that I can find for preemie, but I wouldn't want to give her a, a bigger size. It, I think she could take a bigger size, but I just, I don't want to force it or fudge it. Okay, these are the bottles that I got for Stormy, like this brand, but they have some different ones, and this is so cute. I actually kind of want to get one like this to close the top. Look how this one is, because like this is sealed with silicone, and then this is like fake formula. And I, I like I like making my own because then I can have like whatever baba I want. But I, I did get this one off of um, Etsy just because it was my first time and I didn't know how to make it when I first started collecting babies. But I think it would be really cute to get one of my own and do it myself. And I could teach you guys how to make it and seal it too if you were interested. Shape is so like nostalgic and cute to me. I'm getting so sidetracked. I'm supposed to be doing an Easter basket for myself and I'm just like in the baby aisle. Can you blame me? Look at all the fun we can have. I found a really cute little lamb. What's it do? It's like a sound. How did I, there was a light. <gasps> That's, I love this. That is so cute. Oh my God, and it projects. Why you say it like that? Ha ha ha, chaos. <laughs> Easter stuff, Easter stuff. We need to go to Easter stuff. Baby clothes. Check on the new spring stuff. Really cute things for the babies. Okay, so Ellie's newborn size, so this would not fit her. This would fit Chi, though, and that is adorable. Oh my gosh, Carter's new stuff is adorable, too. That's probably going to be my adjective for this whole section of the video. Oh, what the heck? Disney stuff? Walmart can freaking get it. <laughs> I'm serious. I think they have really cute baby stuff. I wish this was like a little less neutral. I definitely like to do like a little bit more girly stuff, especially as she's like this small, because like I don't, I want it to be very prominent that she's a little girl. Oh, this is not elephant ears. <gasps> Make these in my size. Disney, hook me up. Here, I should get some of the necessities from my Passy shop. Walmart has a really good, at least my Walmart has a really good arts and crafts section. Okay, up here is the Easter stuff, I'm pretty sure. And we really got to get on getting on, cause boy do I dilly dally. <laughs> All right, we have found the Easters. So, First off, we need a basket. Oh, that is cute. There's no, oh, okay, this is $15. But it's also reusable. I can repurpose this. Me trying to validate a silly basket purchase. Here we go. This is what I was looking for. Oh, this is like what I got for K-Cat. Except these ones are really big and they're more expensive. I don't want it that big. I keep leaving my child. I like really want I wanted like a classic brown one. Like I really like this, but I don't want to spend $15 on just the basket. I'm being a little bit of a penny pincher right now. But I mean, there is like the classic pink. I could get a pink one. These ones are, are they really? That's actually so cheap. 
okay, maybe we could do that. Or I could get a green one and do like orange and green themed for super Eastery, but realistically, I'm a pink girly. Let's get a pink one. Oh my God, I can't get it. I need two hands. Okay, I'll just kind of build it here because the rest of the card is full. I need eggs. These ones are bigger eggs. I don't know what ones I want. Jelly bean scented. Smell me. asked about Ellie. Ooh, this is the danger section. Oh my goodness. What a sweet little lamb. You want this, Ellie? Heck. Let's let's message Daddy Bear because he's supposed to be helping me decide. I actually really liked this one, but when I took it out, its ears made me think of like weird pigtails and I don't like that. <laughs> um, there was one over here that rattles and that's pretty that's pretty cute but I don't like I just don't like the rabbit itself I don't know I don't know I'm, I'm being picky okay this absolutely does not match but look I it's I've, it has an egg look at its face there is one that would match my basket better that but it has a carrot I like oh are you okay honey oh my god I'm so sorry I just really like this egg <laughs> I'm being so ridiculously picky about this right now though they don't look like I don't like that the materials not sensory friendly. I'm literally starting over entirely because I want that rabbit. So we need to we need to match it better. Put that one back. It's these eggs. Y'all, maybe I'll stop at the Dollar General on the way home and get the smaller version of this basket. I'll just stop on the way home and grab it <laughs> and hope that they still have it because that's the one that I want. But that one is like really big. Oh, what color grass am I gonna get? Okay, if I'm getting the orange. Green grass? It's only 50 cents. That's cool. But there's jelly bean scented one in green as well. Hmm. Or should I do yellow? Because the egg is yellow. Oh, does that mean I should get a yellow basket? I'm losing my mind. You stay tuned. I'll just show you. We are moving on to the toy section. My freaking cart is gonna wake the baby up. There's something. Something like appropriately sized that I can put in an Easter basket. Of course, I always go to the little people and they have like these like princess add-on things and I have the princess castle. Not that I need another little people set. This is the castle though. This would be like a cute add-on. Oh my God, it's on clearance. <gasps> we should get this one. Oh my gosh, we have to. Little thing, but also it's like a big thing. I don't know. As long as we're in this section, though, I don't mind taking a little gander. I'm kind of infatuated. It's got, like, little surprise lunch kits. I don't know if you guys remember, but uh, last year, actually, around this time, around Easter, Melissa and Doug, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. It's one of my favorite toy brands. They're so cute, and the quality is so nice. This is, like, fun. I want to wanna play with that. What? What was that? Do that again. Do that again. I want to see your little mouth do chatterer from Hellraiser. What do we got? I think that's new. Oh, she's so cute. I don't know what she is, but she's really cute. Does that fit me? Is this a different house or is this the same one? Oh no, we got that one, guys. We do not have that one, though. Oh, these are different. These are like Halloween dress up pals. That's cute. Before I buy way too many unnecessary things, um, I think I'm going to check out here and we are, this car is ruining me. We are going to go to Dollar General and wrap up the Easter stuff. And um, yeah, then we'll build the basket. It's so freaking warm. It's like mid 60s. I'm really glad that I wore a t shirt. Um, so I was trying to tell you guys in there but I got too scared. Somebody, even with my headphones on, even with me kind of, I'm always very friendly but I was like being like a, a little bit like less interested in the conversation to act like I was like talking on my headset or something and this woman was just like, oh my gosh, how old and ooing and aahing over how cute Ellie is and I just go, oh she, she's, she's new, she's a newborn. She's like, oh like how new? And I said, just about a month so 
And then I'm like, girl, this is how white lies bite you in your ass. So then she started asking me about her. Does she sleep well? Is she being a good baby? Uh, yeah, she's great. She just sleeps. It might change. Who knows? Somehow I almost think it's going to be embarrassing if, if I'm like, oh, I tricked you. Haha, ha, it's actually a doll. So instead, I'm just like, yes, I'm a mummy. That is my child. She is one month old and she is heavenly. Wait, why did I even go into that like monologue? <laughs> that kind of made me want to like leave a little bit faster, but then we went to the toy section, so at least we got to do that. But let's go to Dollar General. I think I'm gonna leave her in the car, but um, y'all know the rules. If you have a reborn doll, do not leave that baby like exposed because someone might break a freaking window to get your baby out if they think she's real. We're just gonna go to Dollar General. Um, where'd my glasses go? Okay, I need those. I am blind. Are these vegan friendly? I mean, they're not healthy, but... I love these. Is this a neck pillow? That is precious. Fun stuff. That looks fun. Look at how bad my driveway is. It's just all mud. No so warm today. Uh, but this is, this is so beautiful, right? We're home! We did it! Woo woo woo! <laughs> oh my god, my poor baby is still covered in blankets. When I got in the car, um, there was people like parked right next to me, so I was scared to like take the blankets off of her and then like a bunch of people be like... We are back home. I'm going to try to get Daddy Bear on call maybe? Hello? <laughs> Hi! Hi! Hi. I'm <laughs> sorry, this has to be- I'll do my best. So just so you know, Daddy, your voice is going to be in my YouTube video. Just if that's okay. Okay. Okay, cool. Alright, so- uh, it's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. okay, so if I was a daddy, I would say probably we should start with ripping off all of the price tickets, right? Well, be careful uh, <laughs> with the fingers that is- uh, can be uh, I don't believe- I don't believe in- uh, I don't believe in scissors, so... The last time I got in contact with sharp objects, a boo-boo occurred. So use the thing that uh, Kay sent to you to open the box. But that's a that's that's somewhere that I don't know where it is. I really wish that I could make it so you could see my face and this. I'm sorry, Daddy. I'm doing my best. I but, apologize. Okay, I really, really, really want to open this. Hang on, I'm gonna show YouTube. All right, so if you were to be building this, you have to kind of help me navigate. Like, this would be the first thing, right? Yeah. Okay. That you have to open yeah. and uh, pour a little bit, not uh, a lot. Ooh! To... Oh my god, it smells it. so good! Daddy, smell it! <laughs> Ooh, smells good! Cool. Smell cam! <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be so messy. Hold on, alright, let me pause my recording. <laughs> that is too much. It's too much! I can't make it it's stop! Really much. You know what it makes me think of? When you start making spaghetti and you're like, oh, I don't have enough. And then you put like another handful in and it ends up, oh my god, this is so bad. It's so ugly. <laughs> Take a little bit back. Okay. Uh, out. Okay. It's too much. It is too Try much. It. I can't, I can't fit anything out. This is kind of sensory fun now. Because... Wee. <laughs> And smellily too. That it smells smelly? so good. Smellily? I was saying, oh, oh yeah, yeah, sorry, I keep getting sidetracked. It smells like Cadbury eggs, and Cadbury eggs are a really, really popular Easter candy here in the US. And so it's a chocolate egg, and it literally is like the size of an actual egg, but the inside is this like, <sighs> it's a cream filling, but I swear it's almost like lemony. But, um, I will get a uh, uh, mix of flavors, the salty with the, the sweet with the salty or the... Oh, me too. So, uh, oh my gosh, me too. Like when I go to the movies, if I get like popcorn, I have to have like chocolate or something with it. That's my favorite flavor yeah. combo. Yeah, for sure. But we don't have that here. We have only the butter ones and the salt ones. Wait, the butter and the salt ones what? This is looking a lot better. I cleaned up most of what was... Do you see? I think it's okay. Because uh, the, 
the straw is only to make the bed of the basket. Yeah. You're doing a great job, Princess. It smells so good. I love it. I love it so much. Next, we should probably open these and put candy inside yeah. them, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, do you want to put uh, the blue uh, egg already inside so you will have uh, uh, yeah. an idea how much play, uh, space you have it? Yeah, you know because what's awful? Wait, look side. at look at the size difference of my bunny. <laughs> Oops. He's going to have to sit on the outside. He holds the basket. You're thinking that the next thing that we should probably do is put stuff in the eggs. So I'm going to um, use yeah. my... Uh, now the, the, the question, Princess, do you want to put uh, different things in the yeah. each egg? Or do you want to put uh, what the thing in the uh, one egg? Like a chocolate in one, a gummy bear in the other? Um, you want to mix okay, so I got... So I this was what it was up to you. Should I put like the skittles do we want skittles in the eggs and then i have these to go in the eggs too uh, like 50 50. 50, uh, 50. the skittles because it will uh, rattle Ooh, and... i like that okay what colors should go in here though so i have all of these ones not the yellow ones not the blue one the blue one in the uh, in the baby blue okay the red one and the green Baby blue, red, and green. Got it. You got it, because dude. The yellow, because the yellow will uh, mix with the uh, straw. Okay. Or the grass. Yeah, I agree. I think you're right. I agree. <laughs> Recording. <laughs> I'm gonna edit it. It's okay. <laughs> Stuffing eggs, okay? We're just wholesomely. I thought you wanted to do the skittles. I need more eggs. I have. I have too many. How much was the, the, the eggs? How much were they? Pick up more. And we can hide. I can, uh, you can ask your, your mom to hide in the um, garden. Oh, so you can look at That would be so cute. Okay. Because let's that see. is the uh, uh, American tra uh, tradition. It is, yes. If I'm not wrong. Do you guys not do that? We, uh, yeah, we, we have that, uh, that tra tra tradition too here. Let okay, so yeah, if it needs to be caught, I'm going to eat one of these. Can I eat one of these? Are vegan, yeah? You yeah, can eat. I can eat. It's a snack. Ooh, eat I got it. I... Don't spoil your dinner. Oh my god, my mouth is watering. Next thing that I'm gonna put in, I'm thinking I'm just gonna start like decorating this a little bit because my phone is really, really low on battery. So I'm just gonna kind of go ahead and yep. just hope that you trust me. Actual baby foods. So y'all here on the YouTubies, um, Daddy and I kind of were just like chatting throughout the day, but he basically gave me like <laughs> an amount and he was like, here you go, have fun. So I did my best. I don't know if it went over the amount or not. We're not gonna talk about it. I just got what I wanted to get really bad. And we ended with, oh, this I wanted to talk about, childhood. And so it's like the Hubba Hello? Bubba, what's it called? The Hubba Bubba Bubble Tape Gum, but this is an Easter edition. And it's really cute. So I got some of that. And um, if you guys didn't see, this was like a little tattoo and sticker thing. It was like a bluey one. And I wanted everything to match. I tried my best. I don't know. Maybe I succeeded. No, it's, it's kind of cute. Yeah, okay, wait. Princess, but then. Do you want... Huh? Do what you, you have a, a ribbon so you can uh, wrap around the handle from the basket? Yes, I'll have to look for that afterwards, but I just wanted to show the YouTubies. Show the YouTubies the full product. Here you can look too, Daddy. <laughs> the full product. This is so like if I was gonna like wake up on Easter morning, this is kind of like what I would picture it looking like. Like everything is kind of like, you know, on on like the table or whatever. So that's pretty cute. It's only missing a bubba. Okay, so we might have to go back out because Little Miss Kitten um, didn't think of that and also probably went over her budget. So Daddy Bear and I are going to have to make like um, an extended version of this. But for now, this is kind of the gist and I love it. And thank you so much, Daddy, for helping me get this. Yeah. You're welcome, princess. You're so sweet. I love it. 
Okay, everybody, I think I'm gonna wrap this video up here now that you saw my adorable Easter basket. That was so much fun. I hope you enjoyed seeing my Reborn doll. I hope you enjoyed going out with me. I hope you enjoyed all of the things. Please be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out my JFF for more ABDL lifestyle content, stuff, little space things I don't show here, can't show here, etc. And until next time, forehead kiss.